You know what? Real players can admit when they wrong. You know what I'm saying? I was wrong. So, y'all. <laughs> It's a funny story. It's real funny. You're gonna laugh. <laughs> You're gonna laugh at it. So, um, you guys know in my other video, it was like products I hate, and I was like, I mentioned um the texture ID deep conditioner. Do you like do you remember that? Okay. So I decided to do this texture ID wash and go, you know, which is what I'm popping right now. I, I shampoo my hair, I condition it or whatever. You guys see all this. We we get into that point, but this is the story. Then um I get to the deep conditioning part and I'm like, oh, this look real full. Like full, full. You know what I'm saying? Like I ain't been used full or whatever. Um, but I was like, maybe it just like shifted back. You know how some of those deep conditioners can shift back and just look smooth at the top once again and don't look like nobody used it. So I was like, okay, whatever. That's probably what happened. Cause like I said in my video about products I hate, I used it on my mama and I and I hated it. Like I hated how it sat on my sat on top of my mom's hair. Girl, I then I keep going or whatever, and I put on my um, what did I add? I added my leave-in conditioner, and then I got to the styling cream, and it was used. And I was like, why? I never used that. One. I never used that. So why is it? What y'all think happened? I'm gonna give you ten seconds to figure it out. Girl. I used the cream on my mama hair as the deep conditioner instead of the deep conditioner, which is why I just sat on her hair because it was cream and not the deep conditioner. My bad. My bad. I figured that out as I was like using it. I was like, this is the consistency I was talking about. And I was like, this is such a weird co deep conditioner. Like if you guys haven't seen it, you can't see it because it's white. You guys never seen the texture ID cream. You'd open it and if you thought this was a deep conditioner, you'd be like, this is the worst deep conditioner I've ever seen in my life. And yeah, it's not for deep conditioning, so that. Okay, whatever. End of story. Now we're just going to get into the video. So if you want to know how my wash day with Texture ID went, just keep watching. All right. So we're starting off with their Curl Clarifying Shampoo. And this is a sulfate-free clarifying cleanser. And it has honey in it. And it says it's for all hair types. Actually, everything in this line says it's for all hair types. So that's cool. And as you guys can see, it really suds up. So this is not one that's going to like be like a no poo or anything like that this is actually a, a shampoo it gets very very soapy and it actually does cleanse your hair i actually really like this shampoo um it didn't smell like anything actually nothing from this line smells like anything to me um so i mean it's okay but it was cool i could i could run my fingers through my hair after using it so i was fine with that so now i'm going in with the three times the moisture cream conditioner. Y'all, I actually really, 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 really like this conditioner. It had amazing slip and I could easily detangle my hair with it. And my hair loved it. As you can see, like my hair looks super juicy. Like it looked real good. So I really was impressed with this conditioner. And as you can see, these are pretty, this is 12 fluid ounces. So you get a lot of product and they're, um, their stuff is not that expensive. So after I apply conditioner all over my hair, I then go back to the original um, first section that I chose and then I rinse that out and then I go in with my deep conditioner. Now this deep conditioner is what stinks the most. It, girl, girl, it's so bad, but it's very creamy. If you like creamy, you're gonna like it. And honestly, just add some oils to it and you'll be fine. But it did, it really did good. Like, it is, this product actually did really, really good. As you can see, it melted right into my hair. I was like, wait, this ain't the product I used on my mama. Because, like, it really did not feel like it. But, I mean, it wasn't. But <laughs> um, I really, really like the deep conditioner. I'm, I'm going to have to take it back. I'm, I had to take it back, guys. Look at how creamy my hair looks. It looks so good. So, I have the deep conditioner on. And this is after I let it sit. And now I'm about to rinse that out, but my hair looks super good. I actually just used a heat cap and I used that for about 30 minutes while I ate and then here I am rinsing it out. So just gonna rinse all that deep conditioner out of my hair. And I just decided to do my entire wash day in the shower since I'm already here. So I do have the leave-in conditioner from this line. It's actually a spray. 
So I'm actually just gonna spray this directly on my hair. I tried spraying it on my hand, but I realized it actually would be a good spray to spray directly on my hair. So now I'm going in with the styling cream by the Texture ID line, which is the most popular product. So I'm just applying that um, very heavily and then um, going on top of that with the foam. So I actually use every product that um, I know of that's from their line. So um, yeah, you guys, I'm just gonna stop talking for a minute, let you guys kind of watch the routine. I'm just adding the leave-in, the cream, and the foam. And yeah, I like it. As you guys can see, it's clumping my curls together. My hair looks super moisturized and my curls are really, really popping. So like I said, I'm gonna let you guys watch. I'm gonna shut up, I'm gonna shut up. I'm gonna let you guys watch and we'll be back. Careless up below, seen your pretty soon as you came in that door. I just wanted to chill, got a sack for us to roll. Married to the money, introduce him to my stove. Showed him how to whip, and now we remixing for low. Be my trap king, let him hit the bando. We be counting up, watch our fucking bands go. We just had to go talk much and let him Got 50, 60 grand, 500 grams, so. for one hour and I went to bed okay wrap my hair I have a wrapping video if you guys want to know how I wrap my hair I post it up here now as I told you guys in um, the video I really did like all of these products they were actually really good but it's very 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 moisturizing and the only thing about these products being so moisturizing is that your hairstyles kind of get a little flat they um they won't last as long they get very very frizzy really really fast so, I would highly recommend putting a gel on top of this, but if you had a gel on top of this, like, I think it'll be super, super darn cute, and I feel like that'll be a great wash day. So, I might um, end up keeping these in um, rotation or whatever, because I did like everything. I honestly did like everything, but it still stank, though. I really think I'm going to add some essential oils. I know somebody else said it. I'm going to have to do that because I can't, y'all, this right here, as you saw my face as I was washing my hair, this stank. This deep conditioner really, really stank. It's just so bad. Like, I have, to, I'm definitely going to put some essential oils in there and mix that up because that stink. I can't do that. I can't do it. Other than that, I think it's a nice brand. It, uh, this whole entire line only cost me like 30-something bucks at Salons. They were having a sale. It's like buy two, get one free or something like that. So, um, I did purchase it that way and I don't think their products are even expensive so that's a good thing it's not expensive products and I got good results so I think you guys would actually really like this line but just don't expect it to smell good or for you to be like this and people be like oh your hair smell good or you smell good it ain't gonna happen sis it's not gonna happen 
It's not going to happen. It just does not smell good. I don't know. It just ain't like... Y'all could have put, y'all could have got some grapes and smashed them up, put them in something, banana, something. Damn. It's just, mm. My hair is very, 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 very soft. Like, my hair is super duper soft. It'll probably last me a good one more day, maybe two, I don't know. But I would definitely highly recommend putting a gel. I'm just a gel girl. I feel like these like it's my hair is too frizzy when your hair is very very moisturized if it's over moisturized then your hair can tend to be frizzy faster as well so just make sure you keep that into account um but yeah guys i did not hate the products i like them they are actually good products um so i hope you guys like this video if you did give it a thumbs up and i'll see you guys in my next video bye